Hey shooters, pretty happy guy today. Uh, I've been working with the 224 Valkyrie for about four days now. Um, 18 inch barrel, 20 inch barrel, 22 inch barrel. Shot 140 rounds out of the 20 and 22 inch barrel. Uh, about splitting it about equal, 140 rounds at 100 yards, right after I screwed the barrels on to kind of get them uh, seasoned a little bit. And I averaged about an inch for all 140 rounds. Then I went out to uh, my 450 bay uh, here at the outdoor range or the uh, public range, and I shot, uh, I think, seven five shot groups, 35 rounds, three groups out of one rifle, four groups out of the other rifle, the 20 inch and the 22 inch respectively. And I think we, aver yeah, we averaged uh, 0.75 or three quarters of a minute at an angle. And that's all rounds fired on paper. I didn't cherry pick. Although I'm gonna, with my article I write, there'll be some cherry picking just to show you how what the great potential is for this 224 Valkyrie in a good quality rifle. Now, I just shot 621 yards at this big old gong here, and there's a tape measure. I'll measure it out so you guys can see it. There's the center of that one to the center of that one, and we're under five inches. We're just about four and three quarter inches. Five shots, 621 yards with factory federal the uh, 224, the 90 grain, uh, this is 2700 out of my 22 inch Savage MSR 15. It does 2680. Uh, and that's over on an uh, Oler or Ailer uh, 35P Conograph. I'm a little bit out of breath here because I ran down there and fired the rounds that come running back here to make sure, well, not running, I'm 57 years old, not that good a shape. But uh, I, I hammered my butt down there, got down prone, launched five rounds, came down here, measured them. I'm happy. This is the rifle. It's, uh, I think it's a good looking stick. And this, uh, you know, one of those things I want to make sure I preface here that this may or may not be what you will find in the stores. I got sent barrels and uppers and some lowers and I mixed and matched parts till I made what I thought would be appropriate long range gas gun. So I got PRS stock. Uh, it has to be, it happens to be a 10 meter trigger in this one. Uh, Savage upper and lower, Savage four inch, Savage barrel. And just a flash out around the end to protect the threads. Adjustable gas block, uh, extended length gas, it is a really smooth shooter. It drops the brass in one ni nice, neat little pile. It's really pleasant to shoot. It's uh, you can you can watch the, the uh, not necessarily the trace. You could if I had the sun on the right way, but uh, man, you can spot your shots really easy. It was kind of really cool. I don't shoot much long range stuff, but it was cool to see these little black dots appear through the scope before I could hear the ring of the steel. <laughs> that is cool. Yeah, I know for you long range guys, this is only 621 yards for a three gunner. Who just dropped down prone and launched some bullets, 90 grain bullets at 2680. I think we have a real viable long range gas gun uh, rifle right here. Small frame, lighter gun. I think this weighs, I haven't weighed it. I know the 20 inch weighs 11 pounds, this is 22 inch, so let's add another, you know, six, eight ounces to it. So it's, it's under 12 pounds, probably as configured. I'll have to double check that. But either way, I just wanted to share with you guys 224 Valkyrie is here. It does, it lives up to the hype. It does shoot 90 grain match kings at 2680 out of my 22 inch gas gun. It does produce some bit of angle at 100, 415 and 621 yards. Will it do that further? I'm sure it will. The proof is in the pudding and I'm doing everything I can to prove by factual information and demonstration what this cartridge is capable of. Capable of. And man am I stoked. Thanks a lot for watching guys. Really appreciate your time. Bye for now. Two twenty four Valkyrie, little plate. Number three. There's four. Five. Oh, that group looks really good. Woohoo! All right, this is too cool. The big plate's right there. I already shot the four and three quarter inch group on. And while I was doing some still photos of it, yeah, the rifle fell over and landed against this pole, this post here. So I wanted to verify the zero was close. And uh, I went and shot a volley, and they're all, you can see the dirt splashes behind it. Uh, so they turned out the windage knob moved three tenths of a mil high and it appeared to be maybe a clicker So it was already off to the left a little bit. So I made an adjustment So I probably overcorrected um, 
so that's why I shot a little lower. I was holding right here, and so I went back out and shot it, and then we're, here we are, we're at uh, four, four inches. That's four inch groups. <laughs> so we backed up the four and three quarter with a four inch group on the round plate at 621 yards with the 224 Valkyrie. Savage, uh, the MSR-15, 22-inch gun. Seems to be the one it really likes. 2680 with a 90-grain bullet. Again, I'm stoked. I bet you guys are really going to dig this, especially the guys who are looking for uh, just a top end to put on their current uh, AR-15 lower. Or why don't I just go to Savage and buy the complete gun? You'll probably get a smoking deal on it. Uh, Savage is known for making good quality guns at a right price for the working man. And that's what I am, and that's why I work for you. Thanks a lot, guys, for watching. Bye for now. Woohoo!